What's up, Fisherman Fanatics? So, after the breeding for profit video, I did mention before that we were planning on going to a swap. We did not go. Um, there were some illnesses involved, so we decided not to. However, we did go to our monthly club meeting, and they have a mini auction at the end of every meeting. So we decided to pick up some new-ish kind of fish. Um, I did pick up another group of endlers. I got a trio, uh, two females and a male, for those that don't know. Oh, the trio is, or reverse trio would be two males and a female. Um, but we got a trio of endlers. These are orchid endlers. And they're in the old 20 where the previous endlers were. So we did grab these guys. Um, there's three of them. There's two females and a male, like I said. There's a male and a female there. The other female is probably hiding right now. She tends to do that quite a bit, but um, yeah. So we got these guys, and then next to them, we cleaned out all of the koi sores that were in here, put them into the 55, which you'll see an update on them here shortly, within probably the next couple of days or so. But we got these hybrid swords, and you can see this one, this male over here, it's just beautiful. The long sword with the black lining all the way down the tail is just gorgeous. And you can see that the females even have black on the tail too, which is really cool. It gives them like a twin bar look. Um, really cool. There's, I believe, seven of them in here. Um, we know for sure there's at least one male. I'm willing to bet we may see one more male out of this group. Um, but I haven't really taken the time to look yet. I believe this one swimming here is a male, but I'd have to look a little bit closer to see. But I'm, I'm almost positive that is but anyways I'm sure we got a couple males out of this group and definitely some females but I just want to bring a quick update on what we did get because like I said they are new ish fish we didn't really get uh, like super new fish we've already had swords before but these guys are extremely cool looking and of course with the endlers um, we've already got a huge 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 group of them in the 55 right now but at the same time endlers are cool they're worth a decent amount of money by us um, through our local fish store. So again, if you're doing this for profit or if you're doing it to maintain the hobby, this is the route to go for sure. Um, get the fish that are most populated, populated in your area, the more commonly uh, ones in demand. Or let's rewind and try that again. Try to pick up the fish that are in the highest demand in your area. <laughs> Jeez. Um, that way you, at least you'll know for sure that you have the ability to get rid of them when you need to and it'll help you make some some money off of it and keep you going but just a quick short video today i'm bouncing back and forth between the two tanks as you can see um just wanted to show you the two types that we picked up nothing real really spectacular nothing truly like jaw dropping yet these guys are gorgeous though i really 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 like these guys but uh other than that yeah we'll see what happens endlers tend to breed relatively quickly so We'll probably have a tank full of those in the next month or so, which is definitely not a bad thing. And these guys, swords take a little bit longer to grow out, but they do spawn usually once every month or, or so, depending. It's between 30 to 60 days, depending on how well they are, the water, uh, water quality and how well they're maintained and just their comfort level, how much coverage they have and whatnot. But these guys are doing really well. So we'll see how it all plays out go from there actually there's the other female in the back corner she may be in the process of get away of giving birth she's underneath the sponge filter you probably can't see her but she's kind of hanging out down there she may be ready to drop some fry but just a short sweet video just kind of update on what we got and i will bring another full video tour coming soon other than that everything's about the same if you guys have any questions comments or concerns as always please drop in the box below if you haven't already do us a favor hit that like subscribe and share button Let's get some more people in the fish keeping hobby. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, happy fish keeping.